Hey there again, folks. Welcome back to the Real Long Walk, where there's a floating bed, a magical floating bed. It's a water bed. Nah, not really. Nah, not at all. Okay, yeah, okay. So we are down to our last bed. I would like to see some sheep. Is that too much to ask for? I mean, really? I mean, really? Is it too? Is it so much to ask? To... Any sheep on this island? It would be grand. What if we're... You know, my skin is Luffy from One Piece. What if? What if this is the world of One Piece? And these are all islands on the Grand Land. Did I say Grand Land? What? Grand Land. <laughs> yeah, that was stupid. But anyway, guys, hopefully, hopefully you're having a good beginning of the week. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you're not like uh, Garfield and just hate Mondays with a flaming passion. I mean, how can you have uh, hatred of flaming passion with the gentle rolling music there? Dun, 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 dun. So yeah, I uh, really hope everybody's having a good week. Hopefully everybody had a good weekend. Uh, um, I kind of uh, wound up not streaming the other night. Like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna make the same. Uh, accusation against myself <laughs> uh, once again and say that I'm going to be live streaming tonight on the 16th. Is the day the 16th? I'm pretty sure today is the 16th. Yes, the 16th. Um, and uh, I'm going to be streaming the Minecraft Bingo uh, Sea Challenges. I wound up not getting to play uh, last night. I could have. But I was not in a gaming mood. The music sounds different. Hmm. Hmm. Don't really recall hearing that part, this part of the of, of the music. But anyway, uh, yeah, I wound up having to work a 12-hour uh, shift yesterday, 8 to 8. So after that, I was, yeah, I was not really wanting to be sociable with other people. Uh, I'd already had socialized all the sociables out of my system that I, for the year, <laughs> And, uh, ooh, maybe some sheep over here. Sheep, 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 sheep. Oh, wow, this is actually a good-sized place. Now, let's check this place out. But I think it is just an island. Dang it. Um, so, yeah, I wound up, uh, having to work. Uh, longer than I, than I, uh, had originally, um, wanted to work. <laughs> Though, in a way, I guess I'm not, I can't complain. I definitely could have used the, you know, I definitely could use the extra hours. So I can't complain about that. But yeah, I, I this was not any thing of a bingo mood. <laughs> Or video game of any sort mood. I wound up uh, watching like uh, oh I ate first because I kind of hadn't eat much the whole day. Don't really eat at work. It's probably not healthy, but because of my stomach issues, I try not to eat at work. 
to uh, to to prevent any flare-ups, which was actually probably a very good idea yesterday, considering that um, some stupid people had messed up the bathrooms in that floor, and uh, they were out of order for the whole day. They, ha you know. Please don't come into people's stores and try to steal stuff. It's very... Not nice. It's... it's just just don't do it. Uh, the, the people had uh, tried to steal stuff and went in the bathrooms. Had stuffed the, uh, the packages into the toilets. And, uh, well that was a disaster. So, uh, yeah. Apparently the plumber was not prepared when he came in. Not not saying that it was uh, so crazy, you know, but... Apparently he was not ready, period, for any sort of a... A plumbing disaster of any scale. So, uh, yeah, that's what I heard. Luckily I did not have to work Saturday night. Yeah. So... Yeah, the bathrooms were out of order the whole day. Hopefully they get that sorted out uh, sometime today. With it being a Monday, the plumbing services will probably be a little bit more... Actually, I take that back. I think I think the plumber was there last night. Yeah, yeah, he was. They were talking about it over the radio. Uh, my boss was asking one of the other workers... To go in there and flush the toilets, so uh, so the guy could uh, you know could do his work. I guess he was putting some sort. Of, I'm not. I, I don't know a lot about plumbing. If you didn't know, I guess you know now. But uh, I guess he was having to run the uh, the uh, the wire spinning thingy. <laughs> that's that's the technical word for it, right? Uh, to, to clear out the uh, drain or whatever, clear out the clog, and uh, he needed a, he needed one of the you know he needed somebody to flush the toilet or something so so yeah so yeah he was there last night so yeah it is working good today but that was towards the end of the night <laughs> within the last hour that we were open I think so yeah. So yeah, when I got home, I ate me something, and I watched about 10 minutes of a video, which, of which I don't remember a lot of it because I was already dozing off, and I went right out to sleep. So, uh, so yeah, I don't think I, I think it was probably best that I not, didn't try to do the bingo last night. For everyone involved, I was a little grumpy. That's a bit grumpy last night. <laughs> Um, hmm. But yeah, I'm going to be streaming the bingo seats tonight, though, since I missed last night. And hopefully next Sunday I can, uh, I can join the gang and, uh, do as we've, uh, done. Only I'm going to start, like I said before, I'm going to start streaming them. Because it is single player, so why not, uh... The, my internet seems to like YouTube better, so hopefully, you know, I'll keep a stable connection. Hmm. I guess I can go ahead and talk about. Uh, I did beat Sunday, uh, the Night of the Rabbit. I talked about it, I think, a couple episodes ago. It's a point-and-click adventure by Daedalic, the guys who made the Deponia series that I really liked. Seriously, if you haven't tried the Deponia series, you need to if you like point-and-click adventure games at all. Yeah, it was a... I enjoyed that game really well. It had a good ending, I think. It didn't go a direction that I thought it could have. Um... I guess I don't want, I don't want to do too much of a spoiler, but with stuff like that, there's definitely a direction 
especially with an ending that it could go and this did not do that so I was kind of I was pleasantly surprised mm. and I, the music like, like I said it, it it delivered really well the ending of it was uh, <laughs> like the ending sequences of it was definitely not what I expected it to be it was uh it's kind of humorously, you know, kind of humorous, but yet dramatic at the same time. It's like the, I, I, guess, I guess it's not too much of a spoiler. Yeah, I, I, I guess I can say a little bit more, more than what I just said. Not worry too much about spoilers. Yeah, uh, you have to go to a place or do a thing. Actually, I'm having trouble remembering <laughs> kind of everything that led up to the event. But you wind up meeting the main bad guy and uh, you get trapped in a spell. And you kind of have to put on a show, sort of. It, it was not what I expected to, uh, to happen. Yeah, that was kind of, that was kind of humorous though. You're having to go against the the guy script, which I thought was pretty funny. Okay, are we are we getting the, to some good good section now? Okay, let's assume we're not and go over here and kill this spider that's over here. Oh, there's another spider. Okay, this could have been a bad idea. Got three string. And I saw another one over here. Okay, may as well. No need to fight him any more than what I did. All right, may, may as well make use of the zombie flesh. I guess we'll talk a little bit more in the uh, once we have the spider go away. Dang it! Dang you, spider! Well, there's another one up here. Okay. I hear some swimming. Is a spider? Oh no, that's that's not the spider. Oh, hello, spider. How? Why did I take damage from? Okay, is that all for the spiders? I think it is. Well, hey, we got enough for one more wool, which will be uh, one more, one more um, bed. Go away, guys. We I don't need you. Okay. Well, oh crap! Don't shoot the boat! Don't shoot the boat! Don't shoot the boat! Please. Oh, he's still seeing me. Quit seeing me. You can't see me. Okay, good. Awesome. Oh, well, there's a spider now. Guess I'll go kill him. This will make the nights a little bit more exciting, I guess. That I'm able to fight them uh, without any interference. Okay, 
He gave me nothing. What a jerk. <laughs> gave me some experience. So yeah, another rabbit I, re I really enjoyed. Really enjoyed. What all did I say about it? Yeah, the, the ending kind of uh, left it open for a sequel. So that'll be something I, I, I might look forward to in the future. Yeah, hopefully they'll uh, hopefully they'll do such a thing as uh, make a sequel to it. Hopefully it will be, hopefully it will run better because I, I could not because the game never ran perfectly on my computer, which uh, which I kind of, which, which I really hated. I mean, I didn't really ha hated that it wouldn't run good, but I enjoyed the game enough to where I kept playing it. Obviously, I, I, I beat it. You know, there never were any just flat out puzzles in that in that game, which is kind of unusual for uh, point and click adventure games. I mean, there was definitely you know areas where you have to do like a certain co combination of of or where you have to do an item on another item. You have to figure out that. But I guess after playing Deponia. I came to expect um, other stuff. <laughs> kind of, I guess, mini games would be more the word for it, where you have to, uh, like on Deponia, there was a, there was a, I guess, like a little mini game where you're supposed to figure out how to uh, get. Rufus and uh, Goal to the end of like a uh, to the to the exit of a minecart area, and you have to do it by turning on like the uh, turning on like a uh, the switches or whatever you know. I think we're gonna go ahead and sleep. We'll go ahead and craft the other bed too while we're here. But yeah, uh, the, oh, dummy. Gotta do something else first. I'm glad it just takes uh, four to do that rather than nine. Nah, that makes this a lot easier to do in this circumstance. Um, yeah, there's a part where you have to get Goal and Rufus to the end of a minecart area. But you have to figure out the sequence of switches to to make them be able to get to the end. You know, turnstile. That's yeah, that's the word that I'm trying to think of. You know, kind of like a train. You know, you like the turn. You you did the turnstile, and the train will go this way. You do the train. You do the turnstile again. The train goes the other way. So you have to. There's like these three uh, three different color turnstiles, and you have to do it in a certain order. In order for uh, for them to be able to go through successfully, and at points they would go over, uh, I guess some sort of a button or something in the in the in the tr on the track in the cart, and it would activate that color uh, turnstile. So you would have to try to plan ahead. Now that sort of thing. Um, what's another one? I'm thinking of some, but I'm having trouble really being able to explain it, you know. Or, you know, like there was a part where, uh, in the first one, which I think there's, a, I think uh, I, I did this one when I was uh, going through the uh, the last time on it, when I was, uh, when I was trying to stream it. I, I did do this one, yeah. It's, it's a... Uh, you're you're trying to cut line uh, to uh, in order to see the mayor, and there's these three people ahead of you. So you have to uh, 
you have to get them to all leave at the same time. And the way you do that is there's a board kind of in near, a, you know, kind of in a, uh, kind of near this mine or whatever. And they set up bombs in order to, to, you know, mine or whatever. And, uh, the, uh, whenever you set them off, it'll set off alarms in the town. And you have to put these magnets on, and you, and you can choose where the detonations go off by putting these magnets on the certain buildings there in the town. So, uh, you have to figure out which, uh, you know, which three houses are those three people's, uh, houses. So, that's, uh, that's another type of little mini game. And Night of the Rabbit didn't really have any, not until the end, so that was a little bit of a little bit of a surprise. I I, I guess I would consider that more of a you know, I guess a mini game is what it is, but it I don't know, I've kinda considered that more of a puzzle, you know. It's an optional puzzle. I mean you can skip it any time if if you wish. They're they're pretty nice about that. But but uh it is a puzzle that you can solve to get to you know get to the next part of the game I can't remember if whispered world had that the whispered world I, I, I do remember they did have it did have uh, puzzles like the pony yeah definitely remember that yeah some of them were difficult Hmm. Yeah, I didn't really skip too much, too many of those. Uh, the one I definitely skipped, and it was one of the most infuriating puzzles that, in the Pony series, was this part where you're supposed to match brushing teeth with another person, and that was infuriating. As strange as it sounds, that was infuriating. Hmm. So yeah, good game, Night of the Rabbit. Check it out if you if you so wish. I'm sure that uh, it'll be going on sale at some point during the Steam sale, the Steam Winter sale. So definitely keep an eye out for it if if it sounds like your cup of tea. I think I'm gonna go ahead and call the episode here though for today. Um. I've kind of run out of stuff to talk about. There is something else I can talk about. There is a game that I have started playing. But it was just yesterday morning before work. So I really haven't gotten to play very much of it yet. I mean, it's a game I've played before. So, I mean, it's not like a... You know, not like I've never played it. But I do want to... You know, I'll, I'll give my opinions on it every now and then. You know, as uh, as I keep going through it on, on this series, it's a good game. I'll go ahead and tell you, it's Fallout New Vegas. I've started playing it, even though I'm not streaming it. I'm gonna I'm gonna play it. If I get a chance to stream it, then I'll stream it. You know, it's I just play a jerk character on the stream or whatever, or kind of let, let the uh, stream decide kind of the characters that I am. But anyway. I do sincerely hope you enjoyed today's episode. 275,083. So, uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Farewell.